Hey guys, just wanted to do this video real quickly before I call again. Hold on. Like I said, I want to do this video real quickly before I clock in. I want to touch upon something that Equestria Daily reported, and I actually saw this beforehand on Twitter, uh, before they reported it. Uh, I think before they did, and that is the fact that somebody, and I'll provide a link if I can in the description, um, a fan came up with what looks like very good concept art for a potential uh, Blu-ray release, a complete series Blu-ray release. Well, friendship is magic. Uh, basically, from what they're describing, is to go by four discs each season. Each disc would have a different character or so individually put on there for that season, or how they relate to that season, I'm guessing. Sometimes they might even have two characters. But then, along with the nine seasons, which would be four discs for each season, they also um, went on to, um, you know, con you know, come up with the concept that not only would you get the four discs for each season, but you would also get a few bonus discs um, as well. For example, what the first boat, one of the first bonus discs would be specials and shorts. Well, the other bonus disc would be, I guess, special features behind the scenes, stuff like that. And then the last disc to be added on would be the 2017 movie. And that all sounds great. It really does. But there's a catch, though. There's a bit of a problem, maybe. Now, some might say that totally a problem due to the fact that they've already did this already. Hold on for a sec. Like I said, due to the fact that they already did this already, uh, when they released... When Shout Factory released the, um, uh, when they released, I should say, the the 30th anniversary edition of the 86 movie on the Blu-ray for the first time, along in a combo pack along with the uh, 2017 movie, even though they already did this, still they would have to make some kind of deal or make some kind of arrangement with Lion Gates. To, for this, for basically the second time, I'm um, to distribute for the second time to distribute the movie, uh, but this time as part of the complete series set. If they were to do that, if the concept for this series set was to become a reality, like I said, if the concept of this, uh, if the concept of this uh, fan made, which is you know for Christian Daily to pick up on it and acknowledge it, uh, was it become a reality, then, there, then honestly, you know, there is, you know, there is no doubt what I'm trying to say, and I'm sorry if I sound like I'm scatterbrained and just kind of distracted a little bit here, but like I said, um, for Christian Daily to pick up on it, it does show that this concept art, even by a fan of potentially what the complete series set would look like on Blu-ray was great. But like I was trying to say, uh, Shell Factory for the second time would have to get permission or have to work alongside, um, would have to work alongside um, Lion Gates, kind of work out something, some kind of agreement to allow the inclusion of the movie as part of the set. So. That to me would be the only hiccup, not saying that they wouldn't be able to get over that hiccup and make it happen. It's just the fact that it's one thing I'm assuming to have it be part in a combo pack, you know, have it be part of the uh, Blu-ray, initial Blu-ray release of the 86 movie, the first, it's the 86 movie's debut on Blu-ray, that is, you know, that's one thing, put in a combo pack. But then it's another to want to make it part of the complete season or the complete series set at uh, the entire series. It's one. It's another to make it part of that, you know, kind of included in that manner, if you know what I mean. So, so like I said, 
I think that would be the only hiccup they'd have to get over, but I think they'd be able to do it. Um, but again, again, that would be the only thing I think that would kind of like be a bit of a hurdle, but I don't think it'd be much of one. But again, I'll try to provide a link down below, but let me know what you guys think about the potential of this Blu-ray release, or the potential of the concept art behind a potential from a fan's perspective, potential of what potentially could be, I should say, a complete Blu-ray series a release. Let me know down below. Comment if you like. I got to get to work now, and I'll talk to you all later. But let me know what you guys think. And sorry if I sound like I was all over the place. Good luck. Let me know what you